everyone. Welcome to the wrap party for the Thrive and Revive Challenge. We have made it. We've made it to the end of the challenge. I really hope that you have enjoyed it. I know that I have just loved having a little bit of focus. So thank you so much for joining us tonight and thank you for joining me throughout this whole challenge. Well, you know what a house pilates class means. I have got my house cocktail, so hopefully you have got that too. So nice to see some familiar faces coming from way back from the lives and also some members. So thank you so, so much for joining. Right, so Matt is ready. I need to get the tunes. Throw back, remember my lunge. I'm gonna go and press play on the tunes. I haven't gone anywhere, here I am. So get onto your mat and let's get going. Okay, so we're gonna to come to the end of our mat here. Just making sure that your feet are underneath your hips, toes are facing forward. Good, just arriving here. I just want you to just get in the zone, Get into the tunes. Feel really proud of yourself that you have completed the challenge. This is the party. So, we're gonna make sure that our shoulders are down. Find that lovely length in your spine. Take a little pride in your chest and take your arms long by your side. Good. From here, take a chin to chest. We're gonna come all the way down through each vertebrae, bone by bone. Good. And then we're gonna Move that tummy in, reset, reset, reset. Really send that belly button up through to your spine. Good. Exhale, shin to chest. Good. Using that breath, exhale. Lovely. Inhale, scoop, scoop, scoop. Good. I really want you to get in connected to the breath here. Inhale, exhale. Good. Just feel the music run through your body. Woo! So good to be back live. Good. Exhale, chin to chest. Lovely. Scoop that tummy in. Reset, reset, reset. Okay, from here, we're going to take a chin to chest and we're going to walk all the way down into our high plank. Good. Softly bend those knees. Walk your hands out. Good. Hands are underneath your shoulders. Lovely, making sure that your bum is in line with your shoulders. We're not dipped down and we're not high. Find that plank. Good. Engage that core. Deep inhale. We're going to push back into a downward dog. Here we go. Good. Flow back through into your high plank. Really important here to use those abdominals. Inhale, back you go. Good. Scoop that tummy in. Inhale, come high plank. Find the flow. Here you go. Inhale, back. Good. Exhale, high plank. Lovely. You've got two more of these. You've got this. Good. Breathe. Woo! Good. And find that high plank. Hold it here now for five, four, good. Three, two, one. Lovely. Drop those knees. Find your way into a shell stretch, melting everything down. I've been told to turn it up, so I'm going to get the tunes up a little bit louder for you. Okay, here we go. Coming into your shell stretch. Good. When you're ready, you're going to scoop that tummy in, reset the spine, and make your way onto your forearms. Good. Shoulders are back. Make sure that they're nowhere near your ears. You don't want any of this. Find that length in your spine. Good. We're going to keep our weight nice and centered. We're going to start off with our front leg. Lifting that toe up towards the ceiling. Your knee is going to tap the mat and then you're going to send it straight back. Find that high point. Keep that hip guard down. Here you go. Tap that knee. Good. And back. Lovely. Find that leg all the way through to your big toe. Keep those shoulders back. Inhale, exhale. Good. Breathe. Now what you really want to be careful here for is that underneath leg isn't tucked. That's cheating. So untuck that toe. Rely on your abdominals. Breathe. Inhale, exhale. You tap that knee on the mat. You send it back. Give me five more. Good. Four. Find that leg all the way through to the big toe. Good. Two. 
Lovely, last one. Send that leg behind you. Keep it long. We've got little circles. For eight, seven. Keep it really small. We don't want the upper body to get involved at all. Keep that neck long. Good. You've got three, two, last one. Draw that knee in. Good. Have a little breath. Inhale. Exhale. Lovely. From here, you're going to rotate your right arm. You're going to open up the chest. Good. And then you're going to lift that top leg. Find that leg. Reach your hands up towards the ceiling. Really open up the chest. If you need to take your hand to your hip. Good. From here, we're going to tap them out with our toe. Send it back up. Breathe. Inhale. Exhale. Really reach that arm up towards the ceiling. Good. Find that leg all the way through to the big toe. You've got it. Give me five. Four. Good. Three. Lovely. Two. Keep pointing that toe. Last one. And dropping it back down. Good. Just come and sit back on your heels. Flexing your wrist. Take a big inhale. Good. And exhale. Lovely. So coming back onto our forearms now. You're going to come onto the other leg. So again, keep those shoulders away from your ears. Turn the toe up towards the ceiling. You're going to tap the knee and then you're going to send it back behind you. Square off that hip. Good. Inhale, exhale. Here you go. Tap it down and make it. Good. Really focus on that long line right away from the crown of your head to the root of the toe. Don't be tempted to have a little peek here. I know this is tempting. But keep your neck nice and long. Good, you've got it. Inhale, exhale. Here comes one of those tunes which is going to get you through this. you just got to be careful not to wiggle too much. <laughs> keep everything nice and fixed here, guys. Give me two. Lovely, last one. Keep it locked. We've got little circles. Really make sure that you're keeping it really nice and small here. Keep that neck nice and long. Good, come back to the breath. Give me four. Lovely, three. Good, two. Last one, draw that leg in. Good, from here you're gonna rotate the front arm now and you're gonna open up. Excuse me, you're gonna get my back and then you're gonna open up, long leg. Reach that arm up towards the ceiling. Good, you tap them out with the toe and you lengthen. Good, you tap and you lengthen. Keep going, I'm gonna turn this way so you can see. Good, find that openness, tap. Good, lengthen. Really make sure that we're really keeping the upper body nice and fit. Find that length all the way through to your toe, you've got it. Five more. Good. Lovely, two. Last one. And taking your hands back down, making your way into four point kneeling. Hands are directly underneath your shoulders, your knees are underneath your hips. Draw that tummy in. You're going to take a big inhale. We're going to curl the spine, flexing that spine, press the mat away. And then you're going to exhale, lengthen that tailbone and head. Good. Inhale round. Here it comes. Woo! Good. Inhale. Really send that tummy button towards your spine. Exhale, lengthen. Good. Make sure again that you haven't touched your toes. Keep your feet nice and relaxed. Good. Come back to the breath. Inhale. You've got two more. Good. Last one. And exhale. Good. So from here, we're going to make our way into our side line. So coming onto our right forearm here. Good. Let's stack our knees on knees, feet on feet. And we're going to lengthen that waist away from the mat. Shoulders away from our ears. Let's keep everything nice and open. Good. From here, extend that top leg. Find hip height. Good. Keep it lengthened. We're going to point to come forward. And you're going to flex to come back. Good. Inhale forward. Exhale back. Lovely. Really making sure that you're engaging your core here. Come back to the breath. 
Good. Anytime you start to feel yourself slump, check in. Find that push away. Good. Keep that height. You've got four more here. Lovely. Three. Good. Two. Last one. Good. Relax it on top of that knee. You're going to come all the way down. So finding your full extension, either underneath arm extends or come into a little cushion. And then your legs are going to extend. So find a nice long line. You've got a little gap between your waist and the mat. And you're going to lift both legs. So again, really draw that tummy in. Underneath leg is going to stay where it is. Top leg is going to lift and lower. Keep sending the underneath leg away. You're going to lift and lower. Good. Lift and lower. Good. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Making sure you put a lovely long line from the crown of your head through to the big toe. Good. Keep that waist lifted. You've got this. Keep the underneath leg lifted and pressing away. Good. You've got it. Give me four more. Three. Good. Two. Last one. Now keep the legs lifted. Underneath leg is still lifted. Top leg lifts. Hold it there. Engage that core. Tiny circles back for eight. Seven. Keep it really small. Good. I know. I'm with you. I feel it too. Good. Four. Keep that underneath leg lifted. You've got it. Two. Last one, hold together, squeeze for five, four, lift it, three, two, one, and relax it there. Give yourself a well-deserved little whack. And then you're going to push yourself up, slowly making your way onto the other side, taking your time. Good. We're going to mirror what we just did. So underneath the arm is either going to be extended. I tell a lie, we're coming onto our forearm first of all. So onto your forearm. Knees on knees, feet on feet. Lift that waist away. Top leg lifts. Here you go. Point to come forward. Select to come back. Good. Keep it lifted. You're at hip height here. Good. Find the line. So making sure that we're not curved in the spine. We've got a lovely long line. Keep it lifted away. We've got it. Good. Shoulder is away from your ears. Breathe. Come back to the breath. This is a really nice one. Just inhale to come forward. Exhale to come back. Good. You've got it. Give me five. Good. We can just be on a beach, shouldn't we, with these, with these tunes? Almost. We'll get there soon. Good. Last two. Last one. And relax it there. Good. Long line now. Both legs are going to go nice and long. Underneath the arm is going to extend. Or we've got a little cushion. Squeeze those legs together. Find your little mouse hole between the waist and the mat. Swap shoulder is back. Let's lift those legs. Keep the underneath leg lifted. Top legs lifting up and down. Here you go. Up and down. Good. Engage those abdominals. Keep your gaze straight forward. Good. Breathe. You've got this. Lengthen that underneath leg. Really keep sending it away. Good. If you feel a bit crampy in your toes, just flex the feet. Good. Five more here. You've got it. Keep long. Good. Last one. Keep everything lifted. Top leg lifts an inch above. Little circles. Good. This is going to throw you off balance. So engage that core. You've got it. Use the songs, guys. We've got this. Good. Four more rotations. Three. Lovely. Two. Last one. Woohoo! Whack is needed. Good. Give yourself a good old whack. Lovely. Deep breaths. Good. You're going to slowly roll onto your back snap. Coming into your relaxation position. Your heels are in line with your glutes. Toes are facing forward. Good. Just coming and just giving into the mat. Find that lovely openness in your chest. Good. You're going to float your hands up, up to the ceiling. Interlace your fingers and take your hands behind your head. Elbows are in your crystal vision. Float the right leg and the left leg. Double knee fold. 
Exhale, curl up. Good. Slow tap. Inhale, exhale. Good. Keep it slow and controlled. I know it's challenging with the music. Good. Breathe. Keep looking at your belly button. Good. Elbows are in your grip position. Don't have them too far out. We're going to straighten your neck. Keep everything really lovely and just balanced. Not too far in. Not too far out. All you need is a light jacket. Good. Inhale, exhale. Keep looking at your belly button. Create that space in your hip. We're not just flopping. We're creating space. Good. Send that leg away. You've got this. Keeping your curl up. You can do it. Good. Give me three. Two. Lovely. Last one. And hug it in. Take a deep inhale. Exhale. Let's just rotate our ankles as well. Deep breath. Good. From here, toes and heels are going to touch. Knees are out to the side. Chin to chest. Bring your hands onto your shins. Have a look at that belly button again. From here, double leg stretch. We take the legs away, arms hover, and then you come back in. Good. I'm hiding, and then I'm kicking. And then we come back in. Good. Find that leg. Again, chin tuck. Looking at your belly button. Good. Inhale, exhale. Keep those shoulders off of the mat. Good. If you're really struggling with the curl up, take your head down. Just really be conscious that you're not arching your spine so it's not going into your back. Good. If you can, keep it here. And if you want to, let's add some arms. Arms in line with the ears. Circle round. Catch. Good. Breathe. Keep that lovely length. Think long lines. Inhale, exhale. You've got this. We've got five more. Good. Breathe. Good. Two. Lovely. Last one. And hug everything in. Good. Take a chin to chest. Give yourself a nice little hug here. Well done. This is our last day of the challenge. Woo! Good. And then you're going to come all the way down. Find your relaxation position again. Heels are in line with your toes. Good. From here, you're going to come onto the balls of your feet. So heels are going to be lifted. Make sure that that change hasn't made you go out. Keep your heels in line with your glutes. Good. Spine curl to come up. Tuck the pelvis. Come up into a bridge. Heels come in. Good. So you can send your hips up an inch. Find the height. You're going to come down and up. Three, two, one. Down and up. Good. Squeeze those glutes. Take advantage of the upward movement. If it's too much with your heels off, take the heels back down. Good. Inhale, exhale. You come down an inch and up. Down and up. Keep those heels off the whole time. Good. Find that fight point. Don't rush because of the music. Good. Inhale, exhale. You've got this. We've got six. Five. Squeeze those glutes. Four. Three. Good. Two. Last one. Hold it up there. I want you to stand into the left leg. If you can, with the heel remaining off. Maybe you need to walk in at a fraction again. Bend the right knee. Toes are ceiling. You've got it. Find that leg. We're coming down and up. Here we go. Down and up. Good. Down and up. Really stepping into the ball of the foot of the foot that is on the mat. Give me four. Lovely. Remember the option to take your heel down is there for you. Use it if you need it. Good. Last one. Take the ball of the foot back down if you can. Let's go, guys. Use the tune. Step into the ball of the foot on the right leg. Bend that knee in, toe to ceiling. Here we go, long leg away. Good, and up you go. Inhale, exhale. We've got this, keep standing into that foot. You've got five. Good, four. Lovely, three. Good, two. Last one, toe comes down. So low, you put those heels down. 
Let's come through your spine curl. Melt it down. Good. Roll those legs in. Wide knees now. Little rock side to side. Good. Okay, so from here, we're going to put your legs into a lovely long line. Find this lovely long line from your toes through to the crown of your head. Take a deep inhale. Exhale. Good. Lift your right leg up towards the ceiling. Shin to chest. Grab hold of your shin. Good. Elbows are wide. Hover the underneath leg. Looking at that belly button. Scissors. Here we go. Change. Good. And change. And change. And change. Good. Keep that chin tight. Breathe. Good. Find those long lines. You've got this. Good. Eight more. Six. Good. Five. You've got it. Four. Three. Good. Two. Last one. And hug that back in. Good. Take a deep breath. Inhale. And exhale. Good. I want you to bend your legs. Come into your relaxation position. Take the chin to chest and come onto your forearms. Good. Take a moment here. And then you're going to push yourself all the way up now. Good. Coming onto your sit bones. Make sure that your feet are in parallel. Grow really nice and tall. Take your hands into parallel. Shoulders are down. Good. You're going to come into a seat up. Send that spine back towards the back of the room. Tummy your button goes towards the back of the room. And your hands come forward. Shoulders are coming over your hip bones. Good. And then you're coming forward. Re-stack, re-stack, re-stack. Two of those just to get into the idea of a C curve. Good. Breathe. Send those arms forward. Re-stack, re-stack, re-stack. Last one, just a C curve. And then we are going to add on. Good. Re-stack, re-stack, re-stack. Okay, so from here, back leg. As we extend back into our C curve, we extend the leg forward. Now I want you to bring that leg up to 90. Good. And lengthen away. Good. And in. Keep those shoulders down. Breathe. Long leg. And up to 90. Good. Find that leg. Toes in line with the knee when it comes back in. Good. You've got this. C curve on the way back. Lengthen on the way up. Good. Two more this leg. Lovely. Good. Take that leg down. Let's find that C curve again. Shoulders are down. Two C curves. And back. Good. Round yourself forward. Reset, reset, reset. Good. Two more. Good. And reset, reset, reset. Front leg now. As we come into our C curve, we lengthen that leg away. Good. Up to 90. Toes in line with the knee. Exhale back. Inhale lift. Good. So shine your chest forward once you come out of your C curve and lift. I know the hips are a bit grippy. Good. You've got this. Two more. Good. Last one. Good. Take the soles of the feet together. Press those knees out to the side. Good. Deep inhale. And exhale. Good. From here, taking your legs out nice and long. Make sure you've got enough mat behind you. Grab hold of your arms. See curve. Roll all the way back now. Good. You're going to take your hands behind your head again. Bend your knees in. Toes come up towards the ceiling. Use your inner thigh to really connect here. And then from here, elbows are in your peripheral. You're going to come out from the side of your legs. We're going to beat for two. One, two. Come out. Beat for two. Use those inner thighs. Good. Out. Beat for two. You've got this. Look at your belly button. Beat for two. Keep your elbows in your peripheral vision. You've got this. Good. I know. It's going to get heavy. Really use those inner thighs. You've got this. Five more. Four. You've got it. Good. Dig deep. We're almost there. Good, two, last one, good, and hug 
those knees in. Feel the chest. Good. Okay, so taking your shins here, we're just going to take a little rock to get ourselves back into our four point kneeling. Good. So when you're ready, cross your legs, take your hands underneath your shoulders and your knees underneath your hips. Good. This is the last little bit now, guys. You've got this. Find your tummy engagement. You're going to come onto your forearms. Good. You're going to take your left leg back and your right leg. Come into your plank. Make sure your hips are in line with your shoulders. We're going to tap the knees and then take them back into this line. Here we go. We come tap and back. Tap and back. Good. Keep it in line with your shoulders. Those got that bum of yours. Good. Make sure we're not dipping the hips. You've got this. Eight. Seven. You can do it. Come on. Three. Good. Three. Two. Last one. And come back. Toes and knees out to the side. Well deserved child's pose. Always feels so much better when you've just done a hard bit of work. Connect your forehead to the mat. Take a deep breath. Inhale, exhale. Good. Keep it there. Keep on breathing into the sides of the ribs. I didn't press my timer, so I've been guessing. I've done pretty well, to be fair. Good. Inhale, exhale. Really breathing into the sides of the ribs. Good. And then when you're ready, you're going to take the spine all the way back up. Bring those knees carefully, carefully back underneath you. Make your way back into four point kneeling. Just to tuck your toes. Send that tail going up towards the back. Good. Feel that stretch all the way through your legs, all the way through your spine. Let's walk those legs. Good. Breathe. Inhale, exhale. Keep those hands nice and spread. Nice big foundation for you. Three, two, last one. Press your heels down. Good. Bend your knees. You're going to scoop that tummy in. Reset the spine bone by bone. Keep your chin tucked. Pedal out the feet. Keep your chin tucked. Don't lift that head. Well, blood is flowing all around pretty quick. So it's going to bring everything down nice and slowly. And then when you're ready, lift your chin. Take your arms up to the side of the head. Keep your legs moving. Inhale, exhale. Woo! Good. Really nice. Good. Finding a nice wide stance now. Good. Make sure that your toes are kind of facing forward still as you can. Relax those arms. Good. Deep inhale. Take the arm up to the side of the head. Reach up to come over. Good. Waist brings you back. Load that arm back down. Inhale left. Exhale over you go. Good. Breathe. One more each side. Enjoy this last little bit of time for you on the mat. Good, last one. Good, bring your legs back into parallel. Good, you're just going to take a nice little knee over your toes as you come into a deep squat. Shrug those shoulders forward and back. Three, deep in that breath. Good, two. Last one on this last knee bend. You're going to take your arms up to the side of the head. Push all the crap down. And guys, here she comes. Woo! Wow, that was a high kick. You are done. Wow, thank you so, so much for doing this challenge with me. This is our first proper challenge, this Thrive and Revive challenge here on House of Lattes Co. So I'm so glad that you have witnessed it, you've been a part of it, and you have done so, so well just committing to this every single week and I just think that hopefully this has made you realize that you are bigger than your excuses and your time on the mat is so important and you are important so really continue to take the time out for yourself um, I've got loads of classes coming your way and I'm so excited to share them I'm gonna read this thank you so much oh it's been fab I know I've loved it and here's the little Etty here she is 
And I'm almost forgetting, you're probably sitting there all blooming thirsty. It's cocktail time. So let's grab the cocktails. Go and grab your cocktail. So here's to the Thrive and Revive Challenge. Cheers. Oh, someone screenshot this as well. Cheers. <laughs> Have a swig. Oh, yes. So well, well done. I really am seeing some lovely comments, so I'm so pleased that you loved it. And I'll see you at the next challenge. A new class is coming on Monday. So have a lovely weekend. You deserve a little bit of a rest. And I will see you next week. Mwah.